Hey everybody, welcome. Thank you so much for joining us in here today in our business opportunity group. My name is Timmy and I am a chalk couture designer and master mentor of Team Be Happy. And I'm really excited to be joined by my teamy, Shelly. Shelly, you want to say hi? Hello, everybody. Awesome. So the really the purpose of today's um, little chat here with us is to, first of all, kind of get a sense of who it is that's behind Team Be Happy. You've been uh, joining us and uh, chatting with us in some of our Facebook pages and in our business opportunity group. And we wanted you to get a sense about who it is that we are and hopefully answer some questions that we know that many people have as they think about starting a business with Chalk Couture. So um, we really feel like if you are interested in becoming a designer, we want you to know exactly what kinds of support that you're gonna receive if you join as a member of our team, which we call our team, Team Be Happy, B-E-E, because -E, we love bees, and we also really are always trying to find the positive and upbeat um, sides of things. And of course, today, more than ever, that's super important, I think. So um, we want to start off by kind of giving you a little bit of an introduction to ourselves, um, me and Shelly, and share a little bit about why it is um, we started with Chalk Couture. Um, so I'll start and I'll ask Shelly if she'll jump on in and maybe share her story a little bit with us as well. But um, if you've not talked with me before, you haven't, we haven't had much opportunity to interact or get to know each other personally, um, I am a mom of three. Um, I have now 26 year old triplets and um, I have a full time position working for a software company, which I really love. Um, but I found that as my kids started to get older and got ready to leave the nest, I had some more time on my hands and I was really missing a lot of the creativity that I got to do when my kids were little. When they were big, they didn't really care so much about doing crafts and things with me. And I felt like that big piece was missing. Um, and I was fortunate enough to find a friend who invited me to a scrapbooking event where she was um, doing some scrapbooking for a weekend. And I was going to have lunch with her. And I thought it was just a simple lunch, but um, it turned out that I actually got introduced to Chalk Couture at that um, scrapbooking weekend. And I saw it and I was immediately taken with the products. I just thought they looked so super cool and it really sparked that creative um, need that I was feeling. And what's kind of funny is what was first and foremost attracted me was absolutely the products and I couldn't wait to get my hands on them and try them for myself at home. And so I bought a transfer and I bought some paste and I took it home and I, um, the transfer I bought was you are my sunshine. And that's like one of my favorite sayings. It reminds me a lot of my daughter and, um, I put it on almost anything I could think of. I had a chalkboard at home, and then I had this wood box that I had painted, and then I had a side table. I just put it on a whole bunch of things and instantly fell in love. Now, when I first found out about it, the woman who I met, who later became my sponsor, said to me, you should think about this as a business. And I literally, I laughed at her. <laughs> Because I thought, I don't need a business. I have a full-time job. Uh, been there, done that. I'm not interested in a business. But um, I have to tell you, what happened for me was that people were so taken, like I was taken, that people were asking me about how it is that they could um, become a designer and do what I did. And so that was a little over two years ago now. And today, I'm really blessed with a growing business and a growing team. I have more than 50 people on my team now in Team Be Happy. And we are so excited to welcome new people um, and help them to get started and grow with um, this business with us. So that's a little bit about my story. Shelly, do you want to share a little bit about how you found uh, Chalk Tour and why you stayed with it? Yeah, that'd be great. 
Um, my name is Shelly Alvey. For those of you that don't know me, um, I'm from Kentucky and Timmy is the person, my sponsor, who I signed up under when I decided to become a designer. The way I found Chalk Couture was a little bit different than the way Timmy found Chalk Couture. Um, I had seen it online on Facebook. Another acquaintance of mine had was a designer and had started um, posting some pictures of some things she had done. And I was like, oh, that looks really cool. I've never heard of that. I used to be a paper crafter, but after I had kids, um, and you may hear my kids in the background because they're crazy people, um, <laughs> but um, I used to be a paper crafter and I really loved it. But after I had kids, I really didn't have that much time to sit down and create things that I really loved. And so um, at the time in my life, I was also going through a very stressful time with my full-time job. I am a lawyer. I have my own law practice. Um, so I kind of was an entrepreneur kind of by um, already when I found Chalk Couture and I had been involved in direct sales before, but when I found this, um, I started asking some questions about it and I went to Instagram and just put in the words Chalk Couture and Timmy's name popped up. And so I started watching your videos and I was like, Oh, I'll order a few things and see what this is about. And the first transfer that I ordered was, um, spread kindness around like confetti. So I still have that one. And then I also ordered at that time, the school transfer that you can announce kind of your kid's first day at school. And I started, my, I, I tried it and I absolutely loved it. And then I started learning like that as a hobbyist, you could get 40% off all your craft supplies. And to me, that sounded absolutely wonderful. I fell in love with the products first. And so I thought, you know, I probably am going to spend a good deal of my crafting supply money here. And so 40% off sounded like a really good idea, but that's not why I really stayed with it. Um, I remember Timmy asking me at the beginning, like, how are you, how are you interested in sharing these products? Because what was happening was I was sharing posts of products that I'd made just to, on my personal page. Like, look what I made. This is super easy. Love it. I ended up getting about 10 of my people together that had commented on my photographs. I just personally invited them and said, you guys want to come out to my house and try this. And it was really a very informal thing. They just came over, um, got to keep the surface that they used and tried it to see if they liked it. And I had three people sign up to be designers um, that night. And so that kind of was the start where I was kind of like, hmm, maybe this could be a business for me just kind of to pay for my craft supplies. That's where I was at. Um, and then um, we just kind of took off as a team. We really, um, it's a very positive and uplifting place to be. I've been in direct sales before, and that was not the place where I was with my previous direct sales experience. This is a supportive environment. It's not a, it's not a competitive environment. There's so much positivity here. And that's what really has kept me sticking around is the people that I've met. Most of the people that I've met are from Connecticut. Um, because we went to conference together last year, but they're, they're really becoming good friends of mine. And so I stayed um, because making money with Chalk Couture has become something that's um, kind of a habit with me now, but I've stayed because of the community of people that are here and that we are all kind of striving to be our best selves. And so it's great to have that kind of supportive network. And, and that's kind of my story with how I, it was originally for stress relief. And so, but I've gotten so much more from it than just that. Yeah, I hear you. That's exactly how I started too. I really thought it would just be a great creative outlet, a good old little stress relief after a busy work day, maybe fill some time when my kids were um, away. And then it became something I never expected. It really did become a community. I think that's what struck me. It's even more so than, than it became a business, although it certainly did become a business, but it really became a community, a, a community of people that I was just really excited to spend time with. Um, yeah. And I was just amazed at the generosity that I found in this company from other designers and those that um, came on and to be part of my team as a designer. They just were so happy to do anything they could to help me figure out what was the best path for me and help me to grow. And so I feel yeah. like I've really had a good example about that. Yeah, and you know, in the world that I live in, my other professional world, uh, the legal world, that is something that is really lacking in that world. And I think that I, I found something here that I didn't even really know that I needed which was the community of people and the creativeness and the supportiveness. 
it's just a really great place to be. And I think our team um, really um, exemplifies those values of supporting each other, um, generosity of helping people and just kindness. And so it's a wonderful place to be. And what's really awesome, I think, is that is reflected all the way throughout the company, all the way to our corporate office. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and I think that's what really kind of turned my thoughts about what this could become was I uh, kind of ventured out, decided to go to the very first conference that Chalk Couture was offering because I was really curious if this designer community, this generosity that we were seeing at the designer community level was really what was kind of coming from the culture at the top. And mm -hmm. I found it was. Um, and every day since then, I have only experienced that in a grander and bigger way than I had ever imagined. So it's, it's been really wonderful. So, you know, one of the things that you said, Shelly, that I'd love to talk about is that, you know, a lot of times we get asked or we hear that there is uncertainty, even from people who are just coming on board um, as a designer for the first time and asking, is it possible to make money with Chalk Couture? Mm -hmm. And I know you mentioned just a few minutes ago that kind of how you got started was having an in-person party. Of course, we're in a kind of funny time right now. So in-person yeah. parties aren't really a possibility. How, are, would, how would you answer that question in terms of can you make money with Chalk Couture and have you needed to kind of change how you're running your business since, um, you know, the age of COVID? A, a little bit. Um, I had started at the time that COVID happened, um, prior to that, the way that I really ran my business was in-person classes. I had ventured out a little bit and had done some vendor events, just like, you know, a festival or something where there, you find vendors. I had kind of started to do that a little bit last fall, but my main focus was really my in-person live classes because my theory was if I can get the products in their hands and have them try it, they will realize what I realized when I first started the love of the products and the desire to share it with other people. But that's really, and so that's what I did. I would have probably three to four classes a month, um, either at my own home, which I really focused on because um, it was just easier for me with my kids because I really was building this to fit around my life, not the other way around. And so I did that a lot at my own home. And I think people really found that they loved it because they didn't have to clean their own house to have their, their what most people would call a paint party. Um, but, um, so that was three or four times a month, but then that was going really well. Okay. <laughs> um, and then COVID happened and it's kind of like, oh, well, I can't do the in-person classes anymore, but I still want to share this with other people and all the vendor events that I had thought about doing for the spring and into the fall, honestly, have been canceled. One of the biggest ones I was going to do got canceled. So what do you do at that point? And there may be people that are listening or listen to this after we're done that really think like this is not the best time to join Chalk Couture, okay? Um, because of that. But I'm gonna I'm here to tell you that that's absolutely an, uh, not true. Um, I've had to pivot and 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 really for the most part change how I run my business because right now I can't do the in person classes. So I learned, I taught, I taught myself and I looked at all the great inspiration from the other designers on our team and other teams um, to find out a perfect type of online party for people to do. And so I have been doing live videos myself, which I was doing a little like before COVID, I was doing that, but I really amped that up where that way that more and more people will see what Chalk Couture is. So I recently did a 30 day live challenge where I went live on Facebook every single day um, to show a new project and to show what we're about. Um, some people may not even feel comfortable doing that. Um, and that's perfectly okay because your designership is yours, but this is just kind of how I did um, my business. Um, the other thing that I've started doing is searching out for hosts of Facebook parties. It is a little bit of investment on the part of your host for a really huge return. Um, we have all kinds of training and things about how to do those parties. And so it's really simple to learn. If I can learn how to do it, anybody can learn how to do it. Cause I'm not, I'm not the techie on our team at all. So um, that's been really great. Um, there's a couple of ways you can do that and you can get, you can do it where you get products in their hand prior to the party, or you can do that where you show them how to use the products throughout the Facebook party. Um, okay. 
All right, Lola, just a minute. Sorry, my daughter's right here and she was doing so good, but when I start talking, she loses her mind. Here, just there. Um, and so, you know, that's kind of what I've done. I've also been making it a point to kind of reach out and just check on people, um, at least five to 10 people a day that I just, I don't even talk to them about chocolate tour. I just try to reach out to them and make sure they're doing okay, seeing how they're holding up. Because what I have found is what people are doing right now is they're looking back on their life the way it was before we had so much distance from each other. And they're thinking, I really don't want to go back to some of that. And they're really looking for that connection, that creative, that creative nature that, that they, that they may not know that they need. And they're really, a lot of people are really reevaluating. And so I have found the people that are wanting to do that, that are really wanting to find something that they can use after we return to normal. And even while we're not returning to normal, um, as their creative outlet or their stress relief or their, you know, ability to join a community of people that really can impact their life in such a positive way. Yeah. So those people are out there. Um, and I've really had a lot of success sharing this online with people. People want to see something positive. They want to see something happy. Um, and we've got all of that. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, for me, I have to say that a lot of my business has always been online, but I also like Shelly have done, um, workshops in my home or done them for uh, people at their homes with their group of friends. Um, and of course, I've also had the opportunity to do vendor events, all of which now in, our, in this age, you know, we're not doing. But um, I've had an online vis business um, all along. And of course, I've also had the team building um, piece of my business as well. So those ways are things that became revenue producing for me. Um, what I found that I needed to do in this day, really, as my workshops online, or as my workshops, in-person workshops and vendor events started to um, go away, I did something that I had never done before, which is that I actually started selling my finished projects. Um, historically, I've only just sold our products. And as a designer, we get a website that is all set to go. There's nothing you need to do. There's no upkeep you need to make on it. Um, Chalk Couture provides it for you in total. It's personal to you. And all you need to do is send your interested customers to your chalk site. That's what we call our Chalk Couture websites, our chalk sites. And they can order and you make commission. Um, for every order. Um, so that online business aspect hasn't changed. And as a matter of fact, I've actually seen a growth in my online business since um, we've been quarantined and have been home more. Um, there are so many more people that um, are staying home and are on social media today. So there are, there's a lot more engagement on our posts and there's a lot more opportunity to help provide something to people that they need right now. And maybe it's just something to keep them occupied or something they can do with their children while they're home and they wanna provide some projects with them. Or maybe it's you know a stress reliever after a busy day. You know, if you're in the medical profession, you may want to be able to just sit down and just de-stress from everything that's going on. So we have a product that people are really excited about and are really interested in. So online sales have really boomed. Um, and, you know, of course, you know, it's hard to even get things from Amazon right now. So um, that you can get chalk supplies and create stuff delivered right to your home has been um, very attractive to a lot of people. So I would absolutely say that although my business has changed and I too have had to pivot a little, What's really awesome about this business opportunity is that you have that ability to run your business, how it works best for you, and you can change it up if there are, or if there are circumstances in your life or outside that change and you need to um, kind of read kind of figure what it is that you're doing. So the mm -hmm. flexibility of this opportunity, I think, is one of the things that makes it so awesome. I agree. And I, I tell you what I think that I also realized um, during this time is that our company, two things about our company. Number one, we were already set up for something like this. 
Um, we were really set up for where most designers are going to have to completely, or not most designers, but some people like me are going to have to change the way they do business. And so number two, what I realized about our company and also our team too, is the, the outpouring of support from our company, the training that we've received, the daily um, online um, chalk news, all that kind of stuff. Our company really is designed to be a supportive environment. Um, and so what I really found out about the company and about our team as well is that it doesn't matter what our circumstances are, the support and um, frankly love and kindness that you're going to get from our company and from your team is not going to change no matter what the circumstances are. So I really have been really impressed with the company and our team, frankly, uh, during this time. Yeah, that's awesome. I think you're right. It's always good to kind of step back and just really remember that, um, you know, it's tough going at things alone, but we don't have to go at it alone, either in our business or in our lives, you know, and Chaka Chor can definitely be a part of that. So even if you're just looking for a place to be able to belong and join in with people that um, enjoy the same things you do, this might be a great spot for you just for that reason alone. Um, but of course, you know, that's awesome that right now in April, we are really poised to provide an opportunity for you to easily get a new business off the ground with very little investment. And better than that, not only is there a low investment, um, but you're getting even more for that investment and you have an opportunity to actually earn the money that you put down to to buy your starter kit, you have an opportunity to earn that back in cash um, through some great promotions we're offering this month. Shelly, do you want to talk a little bit about those promotions? Sure. I was actually completely shocked by them when they came out. Um, because yeah, the first time ever, we've never offered yeah. anything like this in the two and a half years that the company has been around. Yeah. And uh, me saying here, I've been with uh, the company since August of 2018 and same here. But the reason I was so shocked is because another reason is because what you get from Chalk Couture, just the initial um, investment that you make and then what you get back from that is already such a great deal. Yeah. Um, and just such a great um, way to start your business. Um, and when I, before I started Chalk Couture and I was thinking about it, I kind of looked around, not with other crafting companies, but other direct sales companies um, to kind of see where their kits were and what the value is. And we are right up there um, in the top um, of what we offer people. So your initial investment as a designer, um, your kind of your startup cost is $99. For that, you normally would have gotten $240 in retail value in your kit alone. But right now in the month of April of, of 2020, it is so um, much more than that. You're going to get a bonus product, um, on trend product right now that you can use to show other people as well how fabulous the product is. And you're going to get our homespun tags with our homespun transfer. You may not know what that means. Don't know. You know, I don't know if you've been looking around, but what I know is that it increases the value of the kit up to $270 in retail value. So that alone would have been a great bonus, I think. Um, but they even went several steps further than that. Um, we have a program that you can participate in. Every new designer is automatically enrolled in it. It's called, called our designer debut program. And when you submit $600 in personal volume between now and May 31st, you will then receive $99 back in cash. Okay. Um, not any, you know, not money that you have to spend back with Chalk Couture, not money that you are receiving in some kind of, you know, designer dollars, for example, actual cash in your commission check, you will receive back at the end of May. So, in essence, you can start this business completely for free because you're going to be able to receive that back um, at the end of that period. And Timmy and I, I know Timmy and I and our whole team will be there to support you, to help you um, make sure you qualify for that cash back program. Um, it's, it's not going to be something, I mean, you are going to have to put some work in, but it's not going to be something that's not, um, that you don't have the ability to reach. It's something that's very right. attainable. Not only that, but in the normal designer, um, designer debut program, when you achieve that level one, which is the $600 in personal volume, um, you're also going to get 
a bonus designer dollars back on that. Um, plus the designer dollars that you will earn for submitting all of those sales. Designer dollars are kind of like Kohl's cash. Okay. But it's not that vicious. It's not that vicious cycle that Kohl's cash is where you just have to keep spending more and more and or submitting more and more. It literally is a reward for all the hard work that you put in for your personal volume that you submit. So not only are you going to be able to get the $99 in cash back, you also will be able to earn, um, let me see, $60 in designer dollars plus the bonus designer dollars. All of that can be spent on new, on new supplies for you and your business or anything that you might have your eye on in the catalog. Then also what is the third part of our wonderful promotion is that if you, if you complete that phase one um, of the $600 in personal volume, Chocolate Tour is also going to get to you another hundred and fifty dollars in retail in in retail product as a bonus. So they're just gonna either they're gonna give it to us at conference. I think I don't know if we're gonna get to have our conference or they're gonna make that right and they're gonna give us a hundred and fifty dollars in products of like products we can use. Yeah, I think so the retired is, products, which are usually really really hot, people want yes. stuff that they can't get anymore. Yes. And so it, it is, I can't, I hope I explained it well, but there's so much to, there's so much to it, but I will tell you. So just think of it like I can complete this first phase of the designer debut program by submitting $600 in personal volume. I'm going to get the investment on my kit back. I've already gotten the bonus products for free in my kit. Then I'm going to get another $150 in products. Yeah. That awesome. alone. Yeah. I, I can't even, I, it's just, I am overwhelmed with the generosity of that. And that not only helps the new designers that are coming on board, but they also continue to care about their current designers. Yeah. So, yes. Cause we get these, some of these bonuses too, like that $150 yes. of retired products. Yes. And a few others. Yes. Yeah. Shelly, you know, one thing I just want to mention is, you know, sometimes there's questions about what PV or personal volume means. Yeah. And really in a nutshell, when um, Shelly is talking about this designer debut program and the $600 in your first um, full month or through the end of May um, promotion is that whatever um, you sell either on your website or products that you purchase and then resell to customers locally counts or anything that you buy personally counts as your personal volume. Right. So, um, you know, as a new designer, you may, you get this awesome kit with, which Shelly was talking about. That's the $99 um, initial investment for U S designers. And, um, you get over, 200 and was it $70 now in yeah. value in retail in retail, retail value, value um, that's included in there. So you've got lots of great stuff in that designer kit. And as a matter of fact, if you're watching this and you kind of want to know what's in that designer kit, be sure to reach out to the person who invited you to watch this. Or if you see it, we will send you a video that shows you an unboxing of all of the awesome stuff that comes in that kit. So you can see it. Um, but you also, as a new designer, get a one-time use 50% off coupon, 15% um, coupon, I should say. That's 15% off of your already 40% discounted price. So what happens a lot of times is that designers will want a few extra things that didn't come in their kit, and they get this opportunity to buy them with that extra discount coupon. Now, once you've done that, we, and you can choose to use it or not, it's totally up to you, but if you want to be able to get those other bonuses and earn the price of your kit back, we're gonna be able to provide you with blueprints about exactly how to do that. Um, we have some awesome resources available to us that can really show you if you want truly to get to that $600 mark that you've either purchased or sold, and, uh, by May 31st, you're going to be able to earn back not only your initial investment, but also get all of that, those other great bonuses that Shelly was talking about. Um, and we have blueprints to show you exactly how you can do that. Just with um, a couple of Facebook parties or a, a bundle offer that you give to friends and family, 
we can definitely help you to be able to find a way to easily reach that minimum. Um, now, just so that you do know, there is these promotions going on, but there, it is not a requirement that you participate in these promotions. Um, right, they're right. great to do, but there is not a requirement that you must sell $600 or purchase $600 by the end of May. That right. is truly a promotion and it's one that you can take advantage of if you wish. If you don't, the only thing that you need to do in order to stay active as a designer is have $150 in PV, in the PV, personal volume again, for a quarter. So as Shelly was talking about, the initial um, great benefit of being a designer is you get 40% off your craft supplies. If you yeah. love this product, that's so awesome, right? Um, and in order to maintain that discount, you do need to remain an active designer. The way to become remain an active designer is to do $150 in personal volume in a three month period. Um, that's it. That's all there is to it. Um, but if you want to take advantage of all those awesome promotions and earn all that extra goodness, um, April is absolutely the time to jump on board because this is when these incentives are going on and they're only good for designers who sign up by the end of April. Right. Yeah. Wow. So, so much excitement. You know, I know we threw a kind of a, a bunch of information at you and I'm guessing you might have some questions and we really hope that you're comfortable now knowing Shelly and I a little bit to be able to reach out to us or to the person who invited you to this group to share a little bit about Chalk the Tour with you because we want to be here for you and help support you and help you to decide whether or not becoming a chocolate tour designer is the right path for you. And if it is, how it is that you can be successful in it. We are committed 100% to making it um, something that is going to work for you. How I run my business is going to be different than how Shelly runs her business and how another of our team members, Eva's on with us, would, would run her business. There is not one right way. We can give you a blueprint if you want it and you can follow it and then you can find your path that works best for you or you can just go off on your own and we're going to support you in whatever way you want. So that's what we're about. Yeah. And it's always so exciting to see how new designers run their business. I get so much inspiration from that just to try new things and all that great stuff. But absolutely. 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 Yeah. If, if you're interested, you've got questions, you can drop them here in the comments or the person that invited you here today, please reach out to them or they'll probably reach out to you to follow up to see if you have any questions um, about being a designer. We would love to have you on our team. Wonderful. So don't forget, the end of April is the deadline for all these awesome incentives. We hope that um, you'll join us and certainly we hope very much that you'll reach out to us if you have any questions whatsoever. We'd love to have you on our team and um, love to be able to support you through the process. So take care, everybody. Thanks for being a part. Bye.